fish eat mussels This ain't no real news But some people may not know it And I thought it might get me some views I didn't catch no big fish this day And I had to have something to show If you are one that didn't know it now you know Yeehaw Alright people, Catfish Dave here um, Blue cats, uh, they eat mussels, river mussels I've always heard this, I've always known this um, And when you find these blue cats they're going to be swelled up like a bloom. Well, I was catching these blue cats off a certain area, and I always let all my fish go. I don't examine them that hard. And, uh, well, I was pulling them up nice and slow. They were still kind of blew up, like they had gas in their bellies. And uh, But I watched them burp up as they come to the top. I said, well, they're, they're just full of something. I'd let them go. They'd go back down, so they weren't gassed. Well, I come back to this spot. It was a slow day. I wasn't catching no fish. Much to speak of. It was a hot afternoon day. And I catch one of these swelled up blue cat out of the same spot. Here comes the waves. Not only is he a dink fish, but he stole my white bass head. I no longer have it. That right there is a gassed fish. I pulled him up a little too fast. I'm going to try to work some of this crap out of him. Never mind. I thought it was a gassed fish. He just crapped out a river mussel. They're feeding on mussels. This fish is gorged on mussels, so they eat the shell and everything. This fish is full of mussels. I can feel him. His belly's just full of them. That's a small fish right there. Uh, I'm going to dissect this fish just to show you the muscles in his belly. First, I put him out of his misery. Right here in the intestines, that's all muscles. You hear him hitting the bottom of the boat? They're all over the boat, man. There's another one. There's another one. 
There's four mussels right there. I got a ton of them in the boat. There's more, all mussels. The fish still has more in it, but that's what I've got out so far. That's why he's so stuck. All this in here, that's another bunch of mussels. Right there, there's the intestines. Look at all them. There's a second handful that came out of that small fish's belly. Imagine how much a big one would eat. These are good live mussels here. They got a lot of meat in them. Look at all the meat in that mussel right there. They somehow digest that meat and extract the shell. I've got a bloody boat, but y'all got to see how uh, Blue cats feed on mussels. Big part of the diet in the summer when they come off the nest. Well, there it is, people. Mussel beds. Uh, if you know where they're at, there's going to be some blue cats around, and they'll usually be fat. Now, it could be a little bit uh, like a shad kill. They're kind of gorged or kind of stuffed. I think you would have to hit these mussel beds at prime feeding times because once these fish gorge, they're just kind of going to be laid back the rest of the day not wanting to eat much. But if you get there at key times, I think they can do you some good. As you see, it swallowed all those shells and somehow it was going to digest all that. I guess they uh, spit the shells out the tail end once they digest the mussel. And uh, well, it's a little educational thing. It's part of their diet. Now, I don't know this for a fact, because I've recently got into boat fishing, but you might can look it up. There may be a way to locate mussel beds on a fishing graph or radar whatsoever. This I have heard. I will have to look into it more. But either way, if you do stumble on blue cats, they are in this condition. They are full of shells. Well, you have probably located a mussel bed, and you know you can go back to that spot. Uh other days and find fish there too. This is Catfish Day with one of those uh, educational type videos. I wanted to see it for myself, like I say. Uh, small catfish. I usually let them go, but this one was a sacrifice for the video. This is a video. There was fish in the video. That makes it a fishing video. This is Catfish Dave with another one, signing out.